Hey, what's going on you guys? Yesterday I had a pretty uh, scary experience with the golf and uh, I want to share with you guys. I was driving and as I would pull up to a stoplight, um, the RPMs would drop drastically like to it usually idles at around eight eight thousand rpms and it'll drop down to like about five thousand rpms and the car felt like it was going to turn off and whenever it was time to go um i would press the gas and it, it wouldn't be giving it wouldn't be getting any power i had to like rev it up pretty high and then i let go of the clutch and then still i had I had, uh, had uh, trouble going to go do 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 and then until it got to like after about 25,000 RPMs in it want to like kick in and drive normal and um, it was getting pretty bad as it went so um, I figured it was going to be the spark plugs and since I was going to change the spark plugs might as well change the wires too so that's what I did it was uh, pretty easy actually it wasn't pretty easy the ones I've done before have always been easy to get to but on this car you have to take off the manifold and um, there's three screws up here I had to go buy some long allen keys to fit in here there's one here and one in here and uh, there is two more back there and uh, I had to disconnect two hoses this one right here and then this one back there and then I lifted it up and propped it up with the long wrench and uh, also I couldn't get to okay the spark plugs are in here I was able to reach those but on the other end of the wires um, this thing was in the way of the air pump or something like that um, so I had to take out three nuts I moved this out of the way and it still wasn't clearing so I had to take out these three bolts there's one and then there's two on this plate right here. Yeah, you see them right here? There's that one and then that one back there. So, and uh, disconnect this wire. So it didn't get out of the way. It's still in, in, in here, but I was able to move it around, shift it around as I needed it. To, uh, and um, I did one wire at a time so I would know where it went. Put it back together. I was tightening this up and it actually broke. Part of the manifold that goes in the back but uh, i think that was just to hold it in place and uh actually before this happened it was making a ticking noises like a little ticking noise and uh i didn't know where it was coming from but uh after doing this oh also whenever i pulled out one of the spark plugs look look how dirty this thing was this thing's like all oh, gunked up looks so gross so uh, this is what I was, uh, this is what I think that was causing it. And uh, I wasn't able to check the the computer until after I did this and I was actually getting a, a misfire code. So I think in the uh, fourth cylinder. So I think this is, uh, this was in the fourth one. So I think that's where it was all coming from. But uh, changed it. Changed everything. Idols fine. Idols were supposed to. Move baby out of the way. 